On March 30th, 2021, neighbors in the House Street community in Belmont, Michigan, held a press conference to speak out against the proposed plans to remediate a dump site operated by Wolverine Worldwide, the company responsible for contaminating the water with PFAS chemicals that have caused harmful medical effects in many of the community members. The event was held in Sandy Winstelt's driveway, directly across from the dump site. And right behind me is the dump site for Wolverine Worldwide. Community members stood behind her in solidarity as she spoke. But we have a number of people in the neighborhood that have battled cancer. We have children in the neighborhood that have had cancer. We've had families in the neighborhood that have experienced miscarriages. Wynn Stelt has also fought her own medical battles. I watched my husband Joel become sick and die from this cancer. I too was diagnosed with cancer six months ago. Wolverine Worldwide has proposed to build a nature preserve over the dump site. The neighbors are not impressed. The proposal that they put through either shows that they're A, incompetent, which I don't believe they are because they run a multinational company, or B, that they don't care about this community. They want Wolverine Worldwide, a multi-billion dollar company, to take an active role in cleaning up the mess they caused. We're looking for Wolverine to step up and be a model corporate citizen to address the environmental impacts decades of toxic dumping has caused and prevent the further spread of these pollutants. The House Street community fears Wolverine Worldwide will take the easiest, cheapest, and least effective option, leaving the problem for future generations. That's why my neighbors are here today, because we feel that someone has to stand up and do the right thing. The message to Wolverine Worldwide was clear. Residents of House Street and our surrounding neighborhoods do not want an experimental solution to address the contamination that has been caused by Wolverine. We want a real solution. The decision is not final. State regulators at the Department of Environment, Great Lakes and Energy are taking comments from the public until April 17th. You can send a message to state regulators by going to michiganlcv.org slash PFAS and clicking Take Action. Fill in your information and submit the pre-written letter or add your own comment. You can be a part of a real solution.